Peace, peace, peace. This your brother Monroe Jr. So, Offset, his lawyer came out publicly and said he was targeted because he's black, rich, and successful. And uh, this, the source of this report is TMZ. And news surfaced noting Offset of Migos was, you know, hit with felony gun ch possession charges after he was pulled over in Atlanta. And then his lawyer came out, you know, and said he was targeted. And his attorney drew fine and spoke to TMZ and said that the rapper did not break any laws and that the police used the lane change issue as an excuse to go after him. Mr. Feinlin said it's a common thing. We're talking about a young African-American man driving a shiny, beautiful luxury car and clad in designer clothes and watches and jewelry. Unfortunately, people in his genre become a target for law enforcement who think that lifestyle is connected to some illegal activity. And that is a sad statement. According to Feinling, Offset was not in possession of any firearm. And that his assistant, who was also in the car, is a licensed gun holder who had guns in the car for protection. So that's that's pretty interesting because in all the reports we have read, nobody has mentioned that the offset didn't even have any firearm. His assistant did, who was a licensed gun holder. So him being a felon and and not having the right to possess a firearm, he didn't have one. So that's key evidence right there per the attorney. You know that needed to be released. So. I'm glad that our, our brother is out. Uh, you know, uh, supposedly it was the lane change, the reason that they pulled him over. We don't know. We don't have the video cam to say whether he was in the wrong or he was in the right. But if I'm not mistaken, they charged him with having a firearm. And in reality, he didn't. So uh, I'm glad that our brother's out, man. Um, I just got to say, we got we to gotta be wise. I didn't. And, I, and all the reports, it didn't say that his assistant was with him either. That's what I was like. I was like, where is his bodyguard? Where is someone, you know, if he going to have the heat on him, the burner on him, well, where, is his, where is his security? You know what I'm saying? But come to find out, he did have his assistant with, uh, assistant with him. And I'm glad he had uh, the assistant with him, somebody who could testify uh, to plead his case. You know, because if, if if the assistant wasn't there, look at I mean, I think he had three or four charges. They were planning on locking our brother up, man. So I'm glad that everything panned out for him, especially with Cardi. You know, just having the baby. You need, you know, he needs to be around uh, to to give that woman, you know, uh, support. Uh, but with the baby, even though they have big buku money and they can hire assistants, but still. You know, ain't nothing like that woman feeling the, in, the, the 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 support of her man. You know, rubbing her and touching her, stuff of that nature. You know, you can't you can't necessarily uh, uh, buy that. So, shout out uh, to uh, uh, Offset, man. Uh, I hope you know uh, our creator continues to bless him with success. Brothers, don't don't think negative about your about your uh, about our brothers who are in the limelight, man. Just think, these brothers come from, a lot of them come from the struggle. You know, they fortunate to come out of that struggle. And they young, you know. So, picture yourself when you was young, maybe with not any guidance, any hardly any counsel, anybody to really just guide you and the mistakes you possibly could have made if you didn't have a good uh, mentor in your life or someone that's trying to always impart knowledge to you. So, our young brothers that come up, let's not judge them, man. They're going to bump their heads. You know, all of us in our lives, at some point, I'm pretty sure, bumped our heads. You know, the person that hasn't bumped their head, come on now, please comment on this and let, let everybody know you ain't, you ain't never bumped your head. So, life, life is about learning, and I'm pretty sure that our brother and, and, and our people in general, you know, you, you know, you got to learn from the lessons. You know, if not, we'll just keep on repeating the same cycle. You know, so and let all of us that's viewing these type of cases, 
let us learn also so we don't have to go through what's said or what you know a lot of these other brothers are going through see that's wisdom when you can learn from somebody else's mistakes this is your brother monroe jr i'm signing out peace